The clouds have moved in and the showers are off to the west. I say showers, some storms are off to the west and there's more to come here as we get you ready for Saturday. I'm going to take you through the timeline. Thank you for joining. Meteorologist Richard Nunn with your Weather Authority update. Let's get you out to the headlines. Overnight tonight, we've got the cloudy skies that are going to continue along with some patchy fog. That's really not much of an issue as that'll get scrubbed away under the breezy conditions for Saturday. Afternoon thunderstorms coming through and the potential for some of those to be severe. Right now, the risk is slight, but that's enough to keep an eye on things here for Saturday. About 8 to 10 o'clock, it's spotty showers. Now 10 o'clock to the lunch hour, here come the storms. The heavier storms look like they'll remain just to the north of our forecast circle, kind of around, say, Macon over towards Savannah and north of Waycross and Brunswick. 2 to 3 o'clock, moving into northeast Florida from about 4 to 6, spreading southward across our inland areas. And then 7 to 10 o'clock, the rest of the front will continue to weaken and those showers will wind down overnight and into early Sunday morning. The rainfall rates, we still could see some pockets. One thunderstorm could leave us easily with an inch of rain. I would say on average about a half inch to an inch with those amounts tapering as you head to the beaches and southward. The heavier will be closer to I-75 and then weakening, in other words. 70% margin there for Saturday. Decreasing numbers on Sunday, especially after about 3 a.m. By about 8 to 10 o'clock, we'll start to clear out on Sunday, leading to those partly cloudy skies. Monday's forecast, shy of the 70s, is as a matter of fact, shy of our seasonal temperatures on Monday. That'll be a cool start to the week of spring break. And for the folks that are heading out for some of the players, it looks like a really nice work week here with temperatures in the upper 60s to the 70s, even approaching the 80s by the end of the work week. That's your weather authority forecast. It's a click away at News for Jacks. A shout away on your favorite devices, and it will be here tomorrow when you need it when the weather ramps up on Saturday.